Hey guys, so I have an unboxing for you. I was gonna wait until tomorrow, um, but I couldn't wait. I wanna open it. It is the special Samhain box that Pagan Parcels put together. Um, you had to have it ordered by, uh, I think it was October something. I'm not sure. They've already sent out all the boxes, so it is already over. Um, he had talked about doing one for Yule as well, so hopefully this will be a thing from now on every, every, uh, Sabbath to get a special box. This is how it came packaged. It's a little different than the white boxes that we're used to. So we're going to go ahead and I already opened it up, uh, cause it was taped pretty well on the top that don't want to see we have our pamphlet and it shows you what boxes they have and this is the Sabbath box it was a um, I think it's the first time that he's doing this um, I'm not 100% positive about that but it's the first that I've heard of it so, um, when I found out he was doing a Samhain box, I was so excited, so I just went ahead and grabbed it. And then it shows over here, I don't want to look too far ahead, because it tells you what's in here, but it's got, um, all about Samhain, and I will show that so you can read it. You've got the uh, correspondences here. You got the goddesses, the gods, the incense, candles, tools, uh, divination tools, uh, plants, stones, and altar decorations. So it gives you a good, uh, good bit of information. On there so let's go ahead and open up the box and see what we got so the first thing on top is a beautiful artwork card you've got I can never I never know if they're ravens or crows. I think they're ravens. And it says, uh, Samhain, honor the night queen and dance with the ancestors. Sorry, I keep hearing something. And I can't tell if it's the cats or not. And it's just blank inside, so you can send it to somebody if you want um, or keep it for yourself. Totally keeping this myself. It's gorgeous. And then let's get all the peanuts out. down there. <laughs> Peanuts everywhere. So the first thing we have sandalwood hand rolled masala incense sticks. Oops, sorry. Here we go. Oh goodness, you can smell them through the box. They smell pretty good. Let's see if we can open it up. Show you what it looks like. There, there are quite a few in here. This is what they look like. There you go. And there are about 
Let's we'll see. 15. Around 15, I think. At least that's what it looks like. Could be counting wrong, but that's what I see. Next thing we have are some tea lights. Just uh, white tea lights. Got four of them. We have a votive, a white votive. We have a oh, sage smudge stick, I think. We'll look at the information packet when we're done and see. It is very strong. It's nice and tight, so that's good. I'm actually kind of excited because it's actually my first smudge stick. Um, I've been hesitant to buy some because uh, I wasn't I, I'm, I'm really new at all of this so I wasn't sure exactly how to use it or what to do with it so I'm excited to try it with this and see how it works we have let's see a scrying brew and it says best done at night has mugwort, oat straw, so it looks like it's a tea. Let's see if we can get it out of the package. Oh, you got a little. Some little tea bags for it and then the tea there you go Sawan Scrying Brew next oh goodness we have oh we have a black uh, taper candle and unfortunately mine did break um it is a little long so i guess it just from the shipping it just broke in the middle so that's a little unfortunate let's see what else we got oh we've got some little chime candles and a purple a black and a white my favorite color purple i love that we've got <laughs> there's still so much in here oh goodness okay so <laughs> we got some herbs we got a Samhain herb blend this is place some herbs in a dish or bowl on your or altar or in any room there you go. We've got some rosemary for remembrance of our ancestors. We've got some Samhain anointing oil. Let's see if we can open that and see what it smells like. Uh, that's what it looks like so it, it won't come out it won't come out super fast so that's good but it smells it smells really good I, can, I don't know what it smells like but it smells really good we got a Samhain incense a loose incense which I've never used loose incense before so that'll be something new for me as well Looks like we have another kit. <clears throat> this one is to make a personal poppet. 
says, a poppet can be used to represent someone else or yourself. They are a very practical and visual type of magic. Sewing magic and knitting magic are used widely by craft witches and can prove to be highly effective. So it shows you what you need for it, um, what is and is not included. So there you go, you can see the all of that. Go ahead and open it up and see what's inside. So we've got the straw, I guess. You've got black and orange cloth. You've got a poppet blend. You've got a stone. And then you've got the pattern for it. And you've got I'm not going to read all of these, but you've got the instructions, basically, for all of that. And it looks like it's a hematite stone, according to that one. So here... Sorry if you hear my son, he is deciding to sing, I guess, in his room. He's supposed to be sleeping. Doesn't always work out that way. So there you go, we've got that kit. And we've still got more, oh my goodness, this is heavy. Okay, oh, we've got a black feather. And I think that's it, other than the box in my hand. So let's get that out of the way. And then we have all of our information packets as well. So I am going to open this very heavy box. Oh my goodness. Okay. So it is a cauldron. It is a very heavy cauldron. But it is beautiful. Look at this. Oh, my little... Get back on there. There we go. Okay. So, there we have the cauldron. And... Let go. Okay. It's not cooperating. There we go. And the lid. It is gorgeous. Look at this. It is very heavy as well. Oh my goodness, it is very heavy. That is beautiful though. Oh, and I'm dropping everything. Yeah. Okay. So, that is our box. Let me get this stuff out of the way. We have our cauldron peanuts out of the way. See if I can get everything in the picture. I don't know if I'm going to be able to, to get everything in here. There is so much in this box. It is crazy how much is in this box. Sorry if I'm turning the camera. Let's see. There we go. A little bit bigger. And put that back in 
there. Our incense sticks. So there's a lot in here. I mean a lot. And then we have our information packets. We have a candle ceremony for the ancestors. Again, this video is already so long. I'm not going to read all of this, but I will show it. You can pause and read it on your on your own if you'd like. We've got one that says ways to honor your ancestors at Samhain. There we go. We've got a Samhain magical workings. And you've got uh, recipes for Samhain. There are all kinds of sheets on here. And you've got, the last one is a Samhain Ritual. And there you go. That is everything in our box, our Samhain Sabbath box. I love it. I love everything in it. Um, I am really happy with this box. It is huge. There are so many things in it. I don't even know where to begin with all of it. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I will have their information in the description and I'm looking forward to the Yule box to see what we get in there. So. Yeah, thank you, Terry. Uh, this was a great box. I loved it. I'm so happy I finally got it. Um, mailman decided not to ring my doorbell yesterday and just leave a paper for me to pick it up today. So, had to get that tonight. And I'm so glad I got it. And, yeah, you guys have a great evening. Bye.